guys welcome to another video in today's video we're going to discuss about how to backup and restore whatsapp on android phone securing your data requires a comprehensive approach with backups emerging as a crucial component while local in devices backups hold a significant individual consistency search for more robust data protection Consequently, the practice of creating duplicate copies of essential data on alternative devices gains prominence. Well, in this context, Wondershare's Dr. Phone WhatsApp transfer emerges as a top-tier choice for safeguarding valuable WhatsApp data through effective backup measures. Are you looking to work on a source that can help you backup and restore Android WhatsApp data completely and which is 100% hassle-free? Well, that's for sure. Vonish's Dr. Foon WhatsApp transfer turns out to be the optimal tool for backing up and restoring WhatsApp data. The steps provided below are a clear description of how this process can be easily executed through this tool. Step 1. Select WhatsApp transfer tool. Well, you have to initiate the process by downloading and installing Vonish's Dr. Foon on your computer. Well, connect your Android device with your computer through a USB, continue to follow the toolbox WhatsApp transfer path to open the respective tool. Step 2. Start backup of WhatsApp data. As it open a new window, continue to select backup WhatsApp messages to proceed with backing up your Android WhatsApp data. Step 3. Turn on end-to-end -end encryption of your Android device. Once the backup process initiated, a prompt message appear immediately on the screen asking to turn on end-to-end -end encryption on Android device. By following on-screen instructions, open settings from the three dotted icon on the top right and continue to chats, chat backup, end-to-end -end encrypted backup. On selecting the option, you will be prompted with a new screen where you have to select the use 64-digit encrypted key instead button. Step 4. Scan the 64-digit key on the platform. While you press the next on the computer screen, you will be prompted to process the next task on your Android device. By tapping on the turn on, generate your 64 digit key navigation, you will be provided with a 64 digit key on your Android screen. By clicking on scan, the platform will automatically scan the key and progress to the next screen. Step 5. Create Android WhatsApp Backup. Once the 64 digit key is scanned, Proceed to select the option of I saved my 64 digit key on your Android. Continue to tap on create and backup your WhatsApp data before clicking next on computer. Step 6. Conclude Android WhatsApp backup successfully. With that, the backup of your Android device is concluded and it is displayed on the screen. To check out the backup data, click view it or continue to press OK for leaning back. Step 7. Start WhatsApp restoration. As you go directly back to WhatsApp transfer to homepage, select restore to device to restore the backup to your Android device. Step 8. Select backup file to restore. On the next screen, select the backup file you wish to restore and click view to preview it on a new screen. Step 9. Preview and select the data to restore. Go through all the WhatsApp backup and view it thoroughly. You can select as much data as you want to restore. After selecting the data, click the Restore to Device button to proceed towards the restoration. Step 10. Start restoration on Android. With the window that opens, click Restore to start restoring your WhatsApp data to the Android device. Step 11. Confirm to backup previous WhatsApp data. A prompt appears on the screen asking you to backup the previous WhatsApp data on your device. Click Backup if you wish to proceed with it, otherwise go for the Continue button. Step 12. Preview Progress. The restoration process initiated and it is displayed with a progress bar on the next screen. Step number 13. Install WhatsApp on target device and conclude. For the proper execution of the process, the platform installs WhatsApp on the Android device automatically to restore all backup data properly. Well, that's it for today's video. Please don't forget to like, subscribe and share. And please go and hit the icon button so you will be notified for any new videos that we are uploading consistently. Please, if you have any other question and you want a specific video, go down and comment below. And please share your thoughts as well.
We are really looking forward to add some amazing value into your daily life of using the apps and Dr. Phone is no doubt a perfect tool that helps you in a lot of applications in your daily life. So that's it for today. See you in the next video. Have a great day.